channel so today i'm doing a, a roast beef um so this is a, a roast beef that i got um from sainsbury's well i didn't officially get it someone got it for me um so i got one of these ones extra lean um so i'm going to give that a go today and uh and make a, a roast dinner so let's get cracking Right, so obviously we've got the joint. Uh, what else have we got? We've got some uh, Yorkshire puddings. We've got some parsnips. I'm gonna have mash for a change because when I do a roast, I always have roast potatoes and I'm getting bored of roast potatoes. Um, some carrots, uh, some bisto gravy, uh, also black pepper, garlic salt, thyme and mustard. I'm gonna use that for the meat. Uh, give that a, a seasoning and we all got here is one of my bowls from Christmas Day uh, Stuffing bowls that I took out the freezer and that is going to be a dinner today Or well, actually breakfast lunch and dinner I only eat once on a Sunday. So first of all, I need because mine's only a little joint so I think I only need like one table uh not table so a teaspoon uh of of each uh ingredient not the salt i only need half a salt because i'm using garlic uh garlic salt so that's the mustard garlic salt i've used garlic salt for a long time actually it's been a while since i've used that uh, uh we need a bit of time See, that should be enough salt. Uh, I'm not using garlic salt because it's out of date. So I'm not using that. It's going to work hard. So we're just going to mix this in. Maybe I'll add a bit more salt. Should be enough. So this one's going to take like 50 minutes in the oven, preheated oven. Uh, 25 minutes per 500 and then another 25 minutes so let's open it up oh. it's quite tough huh? I thought I was heat man but I'm not It's only a little. Oh, this feels nice, actually. Nice and soft. And it's a nice size, actually. To be honest, does does a uh, look alright, doesn't it? So I don't know. This might. Be... I'll rub it in. may not have enough Too much. There's 
No, I see. Oh, look at the bottom. So you have to do all the sides. Front, back, side. Top and bottom. Yeah, it should be done. Now we're gonna go and stick that in a roasting tin or a baking tray, whatever you want. Pop that into a preheated oven. I believe preheated oven it has to be uh 200 degrees or fan 180 or gas mark six for 25 minutes per 500 grams plus 25 minutes it's very important and in the tray it is and now popping it into the oven i'm gonna do a middle shot off there we go guys so that is done so i'm gonna pop that onto a plate and i'm gonna let that rest for about 30 minutes uh, so now I'm going to make a start on uh, the other stuff. So it's going to be stuffing. These Yorkshires, they get stuck so, they, so the foils come out in different shapes. Um, and Parsnips aren't basically ones. So pop those in the oven for about 25 to 30 minutes. Right guys, so the Yorkshire puddings are done, uh, parsnips and stuffing. Uh, sorry about the noise in the background, that's my washing. Uh, I've started the gravy. Now I'm waiting for the water to boil for the carrots. I almost forgot about my mash. Oh, sugar. Too much. Carrots are now in. Well, let's have a little go on this then. Yeah, that's how, exactly how I want it. Medium. I think it's time to serve up. So be. So we're gonna have parsnips. We got the stuff in. And then it's just the carrots. My spaceship Yorkshire puddings. I'm calling them spaceships because that's what they look like. I don't think I'll be getting those ones again. And the gravy. And 
there you have it. My dinner is served. There you go, I've trayed it up on my tray. Serving with a Pepsi Max. Hello guys, so that is the end of today's video. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you um, haven't liked the video, please give it a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I will catch you again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.